Hello everybody, this is Post-Production Lag Spike here. I didn't actually record an intro for this, funnily enough, so I'm just gonna do it now. Uh, welcome to meeting one of Fire Emblem Fates Among Us, also known as Conquest. I put a lot of time into editing this video, so I really hope you guys enjoy it. Without further ado, let's just take it away with the rules. So, we have seven people here, everybody has done one chapter. Uh, I'm just gonna go over who did which chapter. Uh, Linking did chapter seven, uh, Cyan did chapter eight, I did Parallel one, Pavis did chapter nine, Bopper did chapter 10, uh, Speedy somehow did chapter 11 and the run didn't just end there, Jay did chapter 12, and we're, uh, we're there's two people that are traitors amongst the uh, seven of us, and we're trying to figure out who one of them is. One player has to be voted off here. Um, at the end of this, at least one player has to be voted off. You, we're going to be presenting our arguments and whatnot, and we're going to be deciding on somebody to vote off by the end, and um, that's about it. Yeah, um, if you guys want to introduce yourselves, go for it. Let's go in the same order. Yeah. Bopper. Go okay. Ahead. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'm Professor Bopper, and I did chapter ten. That was fun. Oh God. <laughs> I don't want to think too much about it. It hurts. <laughs> yeah, you kind of drew the short honestly, straw there, huh? Honestly, yeah. the fact uh, that I'm... you managed to get through it by itself, like I have, lot, I have a lot of respect for that. Thank you. Finally, someone respects me. The bar is low, but you do clear it. So, uh, I mean, hey, I'm Cyan Yo. I did. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do the thing you asked me to do. Uh, hey, I'm Cyan Yo. I did chapter eight. Uh, that's like the Kilma funny vantage nos chapter. I don't remember if he has vantage nos on whatever difficulty we're playing. It's been a while since we done we've done this. Uh, hey, it's J E I K. I haven't made a fire in the in God knows how long, so I don't know why they brought me on. But uh, I did chapter 12, which is the, oh no, Elise is sick. Let's go get her medicine chapter. Oh. Stay sick. I'm no. Saying, I'm not saying <laughs> <you>. No. <laughs> uh, I'm Lagspike776. This is my channel. You're probably seeing this on unless something horrible happens in the meantime while we record this. I did Paralog 1, which is... Uh, the let's feed Odin all of our EXP chapter. Uh, next up is Pavis, I think. Hey everybody, my name is Pavis. I did chapter, ah. I believe in. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, that's what I mentioned. <laughs> Hello, hi. That's uh, that's the dog. You hopefully yeah. won't hear it on my end, but they hear it. That's a demon. Okay. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> uh, I did chapter nine. Uh, the one where you recruit Nix, and I, I forget the fort's name, but you head into the fort. And Azura's there as well. Uh, it was a fun time. I think it's Fort Dragonfall, but I could be wrong. Thank you. Probably it's that. Thank you. Uh, yes, yeah, Speedy. My name is Speedy Hawk. I um, I make, I do a lot of streams for Fire Emblem. Uh, I'm kind of offended. I did Chapter Eleven. I don't know what lag spike meant by somehow the end didn't run when I was doing Chapter <laughs> Eleven. No, no, no. I meant that the run didn't end after Chapter Ten. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, I'm, I'm okay. So it's just me. So it's me <laughs> getting too bad. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I am. I am in. I am inflamed right now. <laughs> you will be when I'm done with you, Bopper. Huh? <laughs> okay, that's my intro. Go. That's good. And linking. I'm linking seven. Regardless of whether I'm a good guy or a bad guy, I'm here to set things on fire anyway. So it is what it is. You should play. Uh, you should play a uh, triangle strategy that let you set your own citizens on fire. I, I did play triangle strategy. It was very fun. Um, I, I forgot to say I did chapter seven, which is probably the most boring chapter, and I'll be a non-contributor in this conference, but we'll try. Yeah. Okay, sussy baka. I don't know, Hank. You can see you're kind of <laughs> sus. Okay, I, I think I'll just start off things by saying uh, I was the one that turned at uh, least into a wyvern, not because I uh, because I genuinely think that it would have been helpful. Uh, Bobber, did you find it helpful on chapter ten? No, it was, fu it was fucking worthless on chapter 10, actually. <laughs> really? <laughs> you couldn't just put her, put Arthur on her and just send it? Okay, well, here's the problem, because this is where I want to I wanna throw something out here, just something into the ether, which is that whoever changed Felicia into a uh, troubadour, who was I'm it? not, Come I out. don't know who did it, but someone did it, and I'm not happy about it, and that's suspicious to me. What? Why are you not happy about it? Well, because it was, uh, it sort of stacked with the Elise thing where Elise has bad offense. Felicia's not a great offensive character, but it's at least something. So, like, I was down a lot of offense combined with Silas being dead. Wait, wait, do, do you mean wait, excuse me, Silas was dead? She, could she still use a tome? She could yeah, use a tome. You can't go okay, into so she, It wasn't like uh, a haha -ha funny tier, tier one, okay. Yeah, you could give her, you can't even do that's, that in this game. That's uh, so funny. Oh, right. I, I did the chapter after Bopper. 
and I was like, why did why isn't there a tome on Felicia? Like, yeah, like you could just give her a tome, and she like manhandles enemies. Also, Elise actually. Mm. You, uh, also, just for future reference for anybody, if you want to use Elise well, just put Arthur on her. They, I, they, I'm pretty sure they have a support by now, and also he gives a bunch of strength to her, and she has strength plus two. She, she's pro she'll be fine. I okay, feel like we're back. glossing over a really important point of information that was just tossed out. Who killed yes. Silas? Who the yeah, fuck who killed, killed Silas? Silas? And Wait, also, uh, actually, um, Silas is dead. More importantly, yeah. how did you kill Silas? Okay, <laughs> it's, who? Um, it's a long story. <laughs> you have the floor. You see what it happened. That's a little suspicious. Um, on, uh, okay, so basically, Silas died literally for me on turn one of I, I, turn one of chapter nine because it was my first time playing this game <laughs> in like six years, and. Silas missed a 71. It was my last move on that turn. If he hits the 71, he's fine. He completely whiffed it and then got boofed on the deck. I, I should have told you about the dog plays. spot you can have on chapter 9. There's a spot where you can just make one enemy and just make your player phase a bit easier. Pro I forgot to tell. Yeah, I gave everybody some advice on their chapter. Uh, except for, I think, Link King, who was on chapter 7. Because I gave, started giving advice after chapter 8, I think. So you were um, intentionally trying to sabotage me. Okay, understood. Me. So at least into a wyvern, not giving me advice. At least into a wyvern is not sabotage, but it uh, could be seen as sabotage. That's a completely fair. I don't know. I think wyvern Elise is a little... It's a little bit of like an awkward play if people don't know how to like get it wrong. Use it, yeah. Like it can be good, but you made wyvern Elise. I'll acknowledge that's not a meme strat, but it is a strategy that requires that the people know that, like, hey, you gotta get her out of E-rank hell, and, like, uh, deal with never being able to hit anything reliably. The issue, I think the bigger issue is that I wanted to give people a flyer on chapter 10, because I feel like that's really helpful. Uh, turns out it just didn't work, because not only did we not have a, not only did we not be able to use the flyer, but also our, your usual carry on chapter 10, Silas, was dead by then. Uh, but I think that, uh, there's something important that I would like to put out. I'm going to be the first one to put out some sus here. Uh, when I got to chapter, uh, when I got to Paralog 1, I noticed that we had absolutely no money. And that means that Cyan did not visit more than one of the villages, more than like a, he didn't visit all of the villages on chapter 8, which is, which I genuinely think is pretty fucking suspicious because those villages are not that hard to visit. Oh, they're not that hard to visit at all. Uh, I okay. My excuse for this, I was in core. I was like core and quest brain rot at the moment, so <laughs> that wasn't really something I was thinking of. And I was trying to do one like because I think amongst everyone here, I tend to play conquest the most. I didn't want to like save scum to get like the most. Plus, it's no fun if like I make a mistake. I'm like, well, if I make a mistake and then someone like dies or something, or I get like crappy level ups. If I just reset for it, then there's like not really any challenge to it for Sorry, it. You, you, you're not allowed to reset. Dun yeah. dun dun. <laughs> yeah, the, we're running on iron, soft Iron Man state, and traders are not beholden to Iron Man rules. Uh, I'll just assume that you didn't uh, like read that fully properly because the rules have changed quite a bit. And I'll just give you the benefit of the doubt. Yeah, there. I didn't. Okay, well, I'm I'm glad you clarified that this early because yeah, I probably would have. <laughs> I probably would have. I was just doing that more as like a yeah, I kind of played this more than you well but yeah no i just i wasn't really thinking about it. i'm like well i'll just go for it the the money really just puts put us into a tough situation because uh i could have i could have gotten at least like a better weapon and also uh i could have gotten odin and nosferatu which would have made the mid game chapters a significant amount easier especially chapter 10 um honestly considering that you didn't know how to use wyvern release you didn't know how to use felicia and silas was dead i feel like bopper did a pretty fucking good job of getting us through chapter 10 i feel like i would have I would have fucked the whole thing up. I disagree. Oh, no, you because disagree. Because <laughs> Bopper. How'd you not get the dual club, man? What's going on? What the because fuck, Bopper? Wait, hold on. I didn't get, get the, the dual club. Okay, club. so one of it's, the, the thing that's on me is not realizing that F Felicia, I saw Felicia on a horse and just assumed Troubadour. <laughs> I didn't know Shadow was going to That would have probably helped. But like, so when like my healer has become an E-rank axe user, and I have no money, and I have no Silas, it took every, I had to, it took every square of that map just to stay alive. I tried to get as many villages as I could, but Did there was the just a limit to. Or no, because I'm pretty sure that's the hardest village to get, so. I'll have to check. I think I got three of the four in the dual clubs, the one I missed. Okay. You missed uh, the because, dual club? Are because I got kidding? the bottom. <laughs> Which one's the dual club? Is that? Dual club is bottom left. Yeah, I got bottom right, not bottom left. Yeah, bottom right Camilla is straight. Cooks. I'm surprised you managed to get that. Wait, does... Actually, I don't think... Because uh, on Lunatic, Obro has movement plus one, and she can reach that village. 
and normally the only safe way to get that is by having Camilla visit her because she can one round over him. So, well, but that's I what I did because I got an Iron Axe for uh, Camilla and just let her cook up that map. Oh, but that does solve it. Hey, I'm I'm pretty sure I don't know if um well you guys wouldn't know, but Bopper, did you get Mozu killed? Yes, I did. Okay. But that's not too much of a loss. Wait, wait, no, hold up, shut up. You killed Bozu? I didn't, an archer did. (laughs) She's supposed to be an archer. She's not supposed to die to archers. That's not how it works. I mean, just because you are an archer doesn't mean you can't die to archers. Okay, well, like, we didn't use the second seal to get Bozu? Of course not. Do you just want pain? You know we have an archer Corrin, right? Our Corrin is plus best minus luck archer talent. And... And it's, we also Bozu. have Bozu. Bozu is a good Bozu. Bozu. We already have Bozu like wild release as a good investment opportunity in this run. Bozu is fucking trash. Bozu was doing Amelia tier damage to these archers, like so. You just you gotta get her rolling, rolling all right? We do have to get her rolling, but like yeah. I, I don't want to hear it from someone who like fucking brings Wyvern Elise out of left field without letting people know. Like, how hey, else are we you gonna know? have a flyer on chapter ten? Camilla I complained just, like, about Camilla, Camilla is Camilla It's not that hard. hard. I just, I just want to point out, you have not one, not two, not three, but four different units that you can give her for strength backpacks. And Bopper's like, she doesn't do any damage. I mean, she it's doesn't if out, you don't I get was her out of stylist. Stylist. I needed every, Everybody else had to take care of the enemies because the lose condition wasn't Elise. The lose condition was they get to the point. I had to choke up way too many points. I used every point of HP I had on that map. I did not have the time. Okay, Bopper, did Elise have strength plus two by the time you... Yes, I got her strength okay. plus two. Uh, maybe. I'm not sure. I got sure. her strength plus two. I was <laughs> the one who did it. it. I know. People okay, are all right. So if matter. you like got her that, I, I guess it's like, not as bad. I got her bad. like four levels. I got her like four levels on, on Paralog 1. Like, I can't do it. I can't do much more than that. Listen, okay, I, you know I what? Was I'll, using, I'll, I'll, she did have strength plus two. I, I was using Elise too. I was like, okay, it's Wyvern Elise. Let's stick with it. And I still had to like spoon feed her kills like she couldn't you gotta, reliably you gotta put do Arthur on her basically like for no i did I, i'm pretty off. sure i paired her up or you know i might not have i don't remember exactly what i did and tonics are also helpful if you Ooh. look at the map okay well we have no money okay yeah. we don't have money can i can i jump in quickly and re- i mean since i don't really have much to contribute to the conversation i'm just kind of here sitting and taking notes um so we so what from what i hear so far we've got two units killed we have mozu dead and silas dead is there any other one any other units dead that we uh, need to talk about I, <laughs> come I clean jay uh, uh, just don't look, be nice you guys aren't gonna be happy with this one because uh <laughs> this one is out of my control i got crit by ryoma at the very end with who with was niles it? Niles! Uh, no! <laughs> Why was Niles fighting Ryoma in the first place? I thought, okay, I thought, I thought, you know, because it's an escape chapter, so I thought anyone could escape. But turns out it's only Corin, and my dancer was frozen because of the, uh, the cleric on the left. So I was like, okay, as long as I get on that tile, I think I'm good to go. I sent Niles to that tile, <laughs> and then the chapter didn't end. Yeah, surprise, so escapes like, actually minute. sees. Uh, Wait a minute. Big fate so brain like, rot. Yeah, so I like Googled it. I Googled it. <laughs> and Reddit was like, yeah, it says it says just escape, but you can only escape with Corrin. And then I sat there. I think I think in my audio you visibly hear me like like molding. <laughs> that's that's tough. That's like really tough, because Niles yeah. is like so important for this kind of run. Because Niles is infinity replacement units for the rest of the run. Yeah, Ooh. and I, I'm really sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna have to figure some shit out. I also, I, I, I like counted in too. my head. I said, okay, as long as Ryoma doesn't crit Niles, I think I'm still okay. Did you get the armor slayer, Jay? Did you get the armor slayer? <laughs> the armor slayer? Yeah, I'm gonna save you. I'm gonna save, you. I'm gonna save you real quick, just uh-huh. from homie to homie. You're putting yourself in a really bad light, and you don't actually have to let anything loose this meeting because you're going last. Yeah, yeah, but, but honestly, you know, if he's not sus, he, he should tell us. I mean, but honestly, true. like, you are. Well, here's the thing. If I don't ooh, mention ooh. it now, sh- I know I got Niles killed. You don't have to bark at me for it, okay? <laughs> 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 no, but if I don't mention it now, that means I just look, I just look suspicious next time. Yeah, that's fair. True. Yeah, uh, yeah. Did if you get the remember. armor slayer though? I don't remember. I don't remember. I'll be honest. Did you? Uh, it's on the chest. Uh, it's in the chest. Um, did you open any chests? I don't think I did. Ah, uh, fuck. That's gonna you got Niles killed. You didn't open any chests. <laughs> you have Kaze. <laughs> why, why was he up? Oh, true. You have two effective thieves and no chests open. That's fair. 
sucks. Because that, that means chapter 13 is going to get really tough. Like, because using the dual club is, is, is really bad. Losing the armor slayer for chapter 13 is really annoying, too. Um, you're going to have to get... Uh, do, we, do, you, do you remember what level Elise was by the end of the map? Uh, no, I can't even use Elise. Oh, yeah, right. she had uh, the Rona. Um, Speedy, do you remember what level Elise was? Uh, maybe like six. I don't know. Oh, fuck. Looks like, okay, well, okay, let, let me think about this. Um, if somebody before me gets eliminated, it's gonna be 13, I'm gonna be on chapter 14. I can feed the shit out of Elise on chapter 14. I could probably get her to like, uh, 14 and then promote, level 14 and then promote her if I really play my cards right. Otherwise, I'll be on chapter 15, and that's gonna be really fucked up, because I can't do shit for Elise. Oh, God. Um... Oh god, that's I, okay. I still think my sus is going on Cyan for this meeting because mm. I, he he knows enough about. As he said, he's actually played this game more than I have. Even though I'm like the conquest uh, addict out out here, he's played this game more than I have to know that there is. If you have a Felicia and if you have like the units that we had, there were no dead units because Jade. Because uh, I mean, because Linking did a pretty good job apparently. Uh, pretty good there job. Is, yeah, I didn't manage to kill someone in the literal first chapter. Yeah, I mean, they it call me, they it's, it's on a store to Fire Emblem Fates. You, know? you are a Fire Emblem gamer. This is true. I mean, yeah, like, I can they, at least confirm that like there was nothing weird going into my chapter. So there was probably. quite a bit weird heading out of the out of my clear. <laughs> Some of it was my fault, but the money situation, I have to say, the way the reason we have no money is Cyan because that's 10k out of the early game, 20k that you get that's gone. I think I'm not at the time, it, I'm not going to say that you're def definitively the most suspicious person. I feel like Jay is somewhat suspicious as well, but that's where my that's that's what I'm thinking right now. Black Spike, I, I feel like you're somewhat su you're suspicious. You're kind of leading yeah. this conversation. Yeah, like yeah. I was doing a core quest around this time where money's not really an issue because everyone just, just kind of comes with weapons. Yeah. So <laughs> it wasn't really something I. The way I went about Chapter Eight is my operative strategy is I wasn't sure what everyone would like want to use because it was only the second chapter. So I prioritize just giving as many kills as possible to <clears throat> Among Us, as it were. Mm -hmm. So at least that way we would have one unit that you know has to stay alive. It can't be oopsie daisy killed. That'll be pretty good in combat. Okay, I will say that Wyvern Lease in retrospect was a pretty bad idea, but I didn't really fuck the run over. It just was. It was just a. It's just a unit that's tough to use for a lot of the people. I mean, here. you know as well as I like Wyvern Elise. If you want to get that rolling, you'd want to get it rolling. I gave her like half, 95, like not 95, like 85 percent of the kills on Paralog One. That's about I, as easily. That's as the correct it. choice. I get it, but like, ta you made a choice that wasn't necessarily yours to make. <laughs> I mean, usually if you're getting live and Elise, you're doing that. Like, I'm pretty sure you do it before Chapter Eight. No, no, no I, I, you do it either on Chapter Eight or Paralog One. I've Online always done it on chapter eight because it's easy to get a rolling strength plus two and a few, uh, mostly the axe experience that you can give her because of the easy enemies. And like, look, I'm a big Wyvern Elise enjoyer. I get it. But I think coming into it, knowing that the skill level that we like, the familiarity of conquest that we had, Wyvern Elise was, it was an interesting choice if we want people to get through the game pretty easily. Wait a fucking second, okay? I, I'm looking at I'm looking at my clear, and I had I I, I I had her at level not not level six like I said she was at level ten. I don't know what to do. For, I don't know how to help you guys. At, at this Look, point. I I haven't seen your save file. I'm just saying in the abstract, people are pretty used to having Elise's like the heal bot. I'm happy. Don't get me wrong. I'm happy about this, but that's kind of like a weird decision to make for people that aren't super like experienced with conquest. I know for a fact that Elise is level ten. And she has a bronze plus one, and she has D rank axes. You just promote her, put her into malignite, and you'll be fine. I, I, if you I, hit, oh, if oops. you hit, uh, that's 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 fair. But you have fire tomes for a reason. If you hit, D don't worry. I'm also a non-believer in F uh, Elise's hit rates, but Wyvern like Wyvern tries to help with the hit rates. At least yeah, I just want to we... correct really quick that it, it was not a D rank. She still had E rank coming into chapter ten on axes, which mm. made life significantly oh. more difficult. Honestly, okay. Uh, Wait a second, L hold up. Why oh. Why is there the inconsistency? Because, like, yeah. you mentioned earlier Wait, today... I, do I have Do I have Bopper's save file? Oh, fuck, I think that's Bopper's save file. <laughs> Wait a second. So <laughs> you're sorry, giving guys, us, have, like, uh, two conflicting no. weapon ranks. Yeah, the conflicting yeah. weapon ranks because I accidentally had Bopper's save file and not the save file that I was handed. Here, 
let me let me check by the save file that I that I was handed. And I'm sure it will suspiciously be E, but yeah, you, <laughs> you, you kind of like no, it's actually gonna be very unsuspiciously E because yeah. I admitted I, that. I, I don't know. I managed, save files, like I'll say but, this: I managed to get her act rank to D by the very end of it. Well, yeah, it was, so that no, means it you, was no you easy. Are it was no hero. walk in the park. You are the chosen hero for this. I appreciate your I, I appreciate your service. <clears throat> I don't remember what level she was. I said six, but I don't remember. Ten this was like forever ago. It was before engage. I don't remember. I want to. I want to hear from Pavis and Speedy because you guys haven't said uh, much. Hey, uh, I from you guys. I mean, Pavis, I why don't you have go very little. Yeah, I have very little to contribute here because basically I fucked up immediately on my run. Got Silas killed. I think this was earlier in the conversation, but I was the one who switched um, uh, Felicia to strategist. That's yeah. a that's a good play for the, Which for I, the I, eventual game, the rest of the game. It's gonna let him talk. Oh, sorry. Hey. I mean, I mean, that's that's what I thought. Uh, I thought still had healing access, still had tomes. Like I thought that was a fine play. Um, again, my game knowledge isn't that high though, so I was operating with very limited understanding of the game. Uh, the most suspicious thing is a Silas kill though, uh, and I I legit have no defense. That was just an accident on literally turn one of, of the of the run. Like I I have no defense. It was just a, an error. Also. Uh, uh- I have the I have the numbers here. Uh, at the end of my clear release was a level nine wyvern rider with seventy two exp, res plus two, strength plus two, seventeen weapon rank, which is three away from D rank, uh, non forged bronze axe, and uh, she was not at D rank. You're correct. She was at level nine seventy two exp. So Bopper got her like twenty three exp. Uh, she had what twelve speed. Yeah, on the, on the wyvern topic sussy. though. Well, yeah, on the wyvern topic. When I saw that in my <laughs> run, because I am a person coming in with. Plus familiarity. When I saw that on my run, I was like, "Who is throwing?" Because <laughs> yeah. I have. It's because it feels like a throw. Because I don't, I don't fucking know the conquest meta that at least is secretly, I don't know, her optimal classes like is, is fucking wyvern. I just don't. Not it. So yeah. So I looked and I was like, "What is going on here?" And I mean, in the chapter, and it did cause me some problems of like not knowing what the fuck to do with it. Um, and, I, yeah, I also don't, like, even if it is meta, or whatever the hell, or if it is, like, a better than just, I don't know, staff locking her, or just using her as a staff bot, it, it was very awkward for me, because I was, like, I don't know if people also felt this way about the Wyvern move, but, yeah, I, I didn't like that at all. Well, I know it's a common, <laughs> I know it's a common thing, I just don't like it. So when yeah, I saw it, it, I was like, oh, God, we're doing this on this run, really, guys? Yeah, exactly. That's what That's I was what thinking. I was and I just wanted me, to get us a strong that, flyer before Camilla. Yeah, I mean, that that's fair, but like the game doesn't get particularly difficult until chapter 10. I say this and like Silas was dead going into it, but <laughs> <laughs> the game's not particularly well, different, it, difficult pre-chapter 10. Like it, it stacks, and maybe with Silas it wouldn't have been so bad, but being out a healer, you know, and I was not about to go do Maid Effie or something because that would have been the biggest throw in history. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I probably would have just like booted made you on principle just for that. Significantly more difficult to push to get the dual club. So like, I mean, that, it kind of cost that because. Can I just say, you? I mean, if you realize that your healer could use tomes, maybe it would have been a bit easier. I mean, yeah, but she also had to heal because I had no other healers. So the fire emblem machine needed her staves to work. Mm-hmm. That that's fair. I think our our next healer is what uh, child? What fucking? I my brain is just. I think our next healer might be Flora. Uh, no, it's Jacob. We get Jacob, like, a little bit from now. Please don't get Felicia killed. <laughs> yeah, please do not get Felicia killed. Uh, this is gonna be there. very difficult if we have literally no healers. Yeah. Made Effie. You made know what? Effie, yeah. Made Charlotte. I-, I will say, like, collectively, if you do get Felicia killed, I will... I'm, I'm willing to run a made Effie because I've never done it and it sounds funny. <laughs> it-, it is gonna be really bad, but it- as a healer, if you put a men staff on her, she'll probably be able to do, like... A bo- significant, only significantly below average work. You know, we could have just captured a maid, but uh, our Niles happens to be dead. Yeah, thanks, Jim. Uh, <laughs> I look, I look. That's gonna Bro, be a real I made rough. it all the way to the end, unscathed, okay? <laughs> the, the I made it all the way to the end, unscathed. Yeah. All right? Well, wait, I, how, even, how, I even did a practice run on my I'm, own conquest. I'm voting for Jay. I'm voting for Jay 100%. Wait, 100%. I'm just I just don't understand how, because the escape points behind Ryoma. Yeah, so I sent 
I sent Niles. Yeah, and then he couldn't stand escape. on that tile, and then he Raijin. <laughs> well, why did you wh Niles. wait? Well, then how did you get in the situation though? You didn't. You didn't have to end turn there, unless I'm misinterpreting. Like you didn't have to. Maybe he thought right. wait was so. Move. I moved my Corin. I moved my Corin, and then I was like, wait, I'm pretty much done. I can send Niles to the escape point, and I'm done. I'm like done with the chapter. So I sent Niles over there. My Azure is frozen because there's a free staff like, um, like shrine maiden, whatever, all the way to the left. I took care of one, but there's still one more on the left because I converged my entire army to go towards the right side. That way I can. That way I don't have to split when there's um, archer reinforcements. I can kind of just funnel them in one by one, and I can just kind of do whack a mole, right? Why would and you then, go right side? I went. I went right side. I think that's I think that's literally the strat that you told me to do. I told you to go left side because left side is the one that is not in range of the staff user. Oh my god. I told you you could potentially mm. send Kaze into the right side because Kaze would get uh, entrapped and then he could kill the enemies that are on the right side, but I didn't tell you to go right side. You know, Bro, this I'm, is just sounding I'm like backseat Spike, strategies. Black Spike, if you have receipts to this, this is this is pretty damning for Jay right here. Yeah, I, let me just pull it up right here. I, I, I do. I, I, I sent him like literally an essay's worth of advice for Chapter Twelve. I also hate to do this because I really like you, Jay, genuinely, and you're one of my co-op bros. Like we've been through so much together, right? But bro, I, I'm telling you, you if you vote let me, me out, you're, you're, you're throwing. <laughs> you're <laughs> throwing <laughs> if you vote <laughs> me out, I'm, bro. I want to give you a chance to defend yourself. I'm going to ask you one question. I personally uh, don't want to give him a chance, but you go ahead. No, no, I want to give him a chance. I mean, everyone deserves a chance to defend themselves, right? Because I, I'm going to be thrown into the fire next week, probably. Um, <laughs> mm. Because there's going to be actual evidence of playing a, a, a tangible chapter for me. But Jay, you said you just did. Didn't you just say you did a practice run? On his I own did, I did, file. I did, but I didn't complete yeah. the chapter. I didn't uh, finish okay. the chapter. Fair. Okay. Well, that's that's I just that's what I wanted to clarify. That's it. Mm. Okay, well in VC text, I don't know if this is but going up anywhere in the video, but like yeah, there's proof. Like, Lag did send the uh the strategies. Not only did I send the strategies, I gave him like literally the that's ways to get the tonics and <laughs> oh, stuff onto Camilla to kill Rishi. And I'm not reading all of that, but okay, no, I, I believe you. Jay for not following happened. this advice. If you sent yeah, this to me, I would just fucking ignore it. I, I, I promise you, I You're promise literally... you I read it. I promise you I read it. But that I being said, really I, I will say some of this there. is completely inapplicable because we yeah. didn't have a dual club going into this chapter, so some of it was inapplic gotcha. inapplicable. But I, I even have, like you'll see on the top one, I have the staff range. I have the staff range over here, or like the enemy range. For example, I can, I can tell you, the left door can be opened without being an enemy range. The right door cannot. If you want to get the treasure on this map, and I recommend it, the better idea to send Niles plus everyone else to the left side and send Kaze to the right side. On the right side, outside of enemy attack range, there is a shrine maybe with Entrap that can still target you, and that's your way to safely get into the top right loop. Now, Kaze has a lot of res, so it might be a bit difficult, but even then, those shrine maidens have a lot of hit with those games, so you should be fine. Okay, understood. You, you gave him a strategy, didn't quite follow it. The thing that kind of makes me raise an eyebrow is that Killing Niles is effectively killing, like... 40 units? A, yeah, a lot of units. Like, that's a very efficient murder right there. Yeah. I know this isn't Lunatic, so we're probably not going to need, like, a uh, ha-ha funny Falcon Knights with, like, S-rank staves or something, but... I mean, at this point, we might, actually. I mean, we're still... I'm definitely going to fucking... If I have the opportunity, I'm definitely going to fucking... Oh, wait, I can't. I, I was just going to say I'm definitely going to capture Kumbagera. Literally not possible. No, uh, I'm definitely going to do what... what I, everything I can to get our units married so we can get child units as replacements. That's the thing. So I, I was actually wanting to bring this up with you guys because we haven't had a chance to talk about paralogs yet. How do you guys want to handle the paralogs? Because I was thinking- Maybe either... not in this meeting. Yeah, that's, that's something fair. something we do on this. Yeah, cart before the horse. Well, we'll do that in the next meeting. I think your current strategy is not the play, but we'll get to that when we get to that. Anyway, uh, getting back on topic here. Uh, we're what? Does anyone have like any more context they want to give about their chapter or things they found suspicious? Like I can't really say context. much of anything since the only context Speedy's I had to go turn. off of. Um, Speedy's turn. Oh, Gulp. going down. All right, Mr. Uh, Hawk. Guys, nothing suspicious happened during my chapter. Um, gulp. Um, <laughs> I don't know. I just played it normally. I, the things that I noticed that were suspicious: Silas and Mosey were dead. The dual club was missing. Uh, Wyvern Elise was there. I realized that. I wanted another staff unit, so I spent. I took the liberty to spend our gold to promote Mr. Niles to have another staff unit. So, he um, died while promoted. That makes yeah, it was, so much worse. Wait, no. He was promoted. Oh my um, 
Oh, yeah, I mean, no, I don't think nothing happened this is, on my this, chapter. The cell job's getting chest. worse. He got crit, dude. It was out of my control. You, why did you end him in range of a guy that doesn't move? Did you get the chest on chapter 11? I thought anyone could escape! I thought anyone well, but why would you put the, They would put the escape button on the thing. You hit wait. No, you were like, oh, I'll just wait here right in range of Ryan Jinto. It says escape or defeat Ryoma. So I thought anyone could escape. But I, I, end, I put Niles there. The chapter didn't end. So I literally, in my recording, go and Google and you hear me slam my desk out of frustration. <laughs> well, that's the great thing. I somehow made it to there without dying i was i don't know how else to say it i was i'm just well, as just, mad as you i'm just are. thinking of every fire emblem map that has an escape objective has the big escape button that you click yeah it's the same with seeds you don't just put you don't just put boy on put the it, throne it's all like, of a sudden so yeah i'm supposed to believe jay that your brain just broke for the first objective in history where you just wait on there like it's that one random fe7 chapter i'm 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 i'm, I'm, I'm no uh, there's 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 two get three chapters points. in conquest that require you to escape, but there's a specific, but in the other conquest chapter, you had to escape with literally everyone. So I thought, okay, if that's how oh. that one works, then you can probably escape with just anyone here. I just want you to know, Jay, it says escape with everyone on chapter 15's objectives. We haven't gotten there. That's that. Yeah, that is true. I I'm a little you know sympathetic that, like, because I have fumbled the bag on chapter 15 before, so. Yeah. So I know I, it's possible, I, but it is really I suspicious. I genuinely thought anyone could escape this chapter, and if you find that suspicious, then like, okay, like I can't do anything. Well, about I mean, it, to but... your credit, you didn't have to bring this up, and you brought it up. So, I mean, so it, it would like, be found like out like thing. immediately. Yeah, yeah, I think if you didn't bring up Niles, that would have been like the biggest red flag. But for next week, okay, uh, I just wanted to get some. I just want to get some stuff out of the way. This is not like sus or anything. I just want to know where the stuff went. So, uh, for the so there's a bunch of loot on this in this game so far. Uh, I want to go. Did we get the rescue staff on chapter nine? Um, yeah, I used it. Uh, we had a rescue chapter, right? We had okay. a rescue staff, and I used it by accident. <laughs> okay, I've, all right. I've did we get the gold? Did we get so, Bobber? You got all the other three villages. Did you use the Draco shield or the Master so Seal on? I I got. I, I double checked my video. I only got the top two villages, but I did not use either item. I didn't use anything that I got. Well, you only get the master seal in the top right village, so you didn't use the master seal. So that, let's just assume that master seal was used on dials, because why the fuck would you spend another two k gold on that? Uh, next up is chapter eleven. Did you get the Did you get the spirit dust and the enfeeble? Yes. Uh, did you use them on anybody? I don't remember. Okay, well, even if, if you didn't use them, that's fine. Like, we got them, that's nice. No, no I, I think the I... Enfeeble, the Enfeeble was still there when I think I, I used this. I used the Spirit Dust because I didn't want a traitor to throw it away. So I'm pretty sure I gave it to whoever uses magic, but I don't remember. It's probably Felicia or Elise in that case. Um, uh, it was probably Felicia. Or maybe Odin. Uh, Jay, did you... Odin, it might have been you, Odin too, yeah. You didn't get the Armor Slayer. Did you get the other chest with 5,000 gold in it? No. Did you get no. the Dual Katana? No. I mean, not the dual katana, the, 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 what is it, Kodachi? I probably did, yeah, I probably got that one. Um, I, there wasn't really any loot on my chapter, but I, you know, I killed all the enemies, I guess, even though it's a route map, but, um, I kept Mozu alive, I did what I could, um, yeah. Now, using one rescue use isn't that bad, if you use the second rescue use, somebody's gonna have to play chapter 20 legit, and that's gonna be fucked up. <laughs> yeah, I think I was trying to heal someone, and then it was rescue, so I had one tile rescue the person. <laughs> <laughs> it's like those, so it's like, it's like those warp mages on, in Radiant Dawn, where they just rescue them to the exact tile that they were on. I think I that's am. pretty much, I don't remember exactly what happened, but I remember going like, oh fuck, they're gonna see that. <laughs> that the sounds recording. like just the move that someone who doesn't want to sound too suspicious Why would I? Why would I admit off. that? Because because it feels honest. Because also, if you didn't admit it and it got to me, I would, I, I would notice that the rescue use was gone. Well, we're voting yeah, you out, and then so I would just, notice. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I know who I think is sus. We okay. we're kind of like tallying things up in VC chat, like who made oopsie yeah. daisies. I just yeah. want to say that I think Cyan sounds a little sus for not getting the gold. Okay. I believe that Bopper probably struggled on 10. Yeah, I, I'm not going to put anything yeah. on Bopper. I Bro think... had a, a horrible situation, and he did not fumble it. And I have I, I owe the fact that this run is still going to Bopper, so I don't feel comfortable voting for him. I mean, I think Lagspike has been leading this conversation a lot. I think I mean, it's, that's a it's our thing. It's a collective thing. You've collaborated with people before. You know that's, how this works. Fair. 
That's fair, I but I'm just saying think... the reason I've been leading is because, like, this is, I, I've just been trying to make sure that we get all the points in Ross. You're also extremely defensive. Yeah, you you are kind of. Well, uh, hold on, hold on. I also think someone has bit. the perfect alibi here. Yeah, me. And it makes them very suspicious. I don't know if that's enough to fu listen. Uh, okay, I'm just saying, I get Link, the game, all Link like, had to do was now? remain squeaky clean, and he see... would go undetected. Yeah, I could see Link just dancing around in his jammies the second he saw I'm the traitor. I get the <laughs> first not, chapter. I'm not wearing pants. Because that was just a free. That was because if you're the traitor, that's the most free chapter in history. All you have to it do is not be bro, obvious. I, I mean, wish. I wish. I was a traitor, and I had well, a chapter that wasn't free, because then I could actually do something <laughs> without me coming in here. I've already got a target on my back. You guys are voting me out no matter if I'm a traitor, if I'm not. Like, you're going to pull the trigger just because it's me. I'm so I wish saying. I could have done something. I I, uh, I I will say that uh, Wyron Elise was a bad play in retrospect, but I did my best. I got her to level 9. Like, she was one, she's like 23 XP away from, uh, 27 XP away from promotion. Um, you know, like, uh, and you promote her, you get her into Malignite, she gets a fire tome, and she starts killing enemies like it's nobody's business. Uh, I did the best I could. Uh, I, I can't really... Uh, Long term, it'll be an okay play. It, I think it'll be better than an okay play, because she's going to be, like... Because if somebody kills, like, uh... Because, like, Baruka, Baruka is honestly probably more of a pain to use than Elise is, because at least Elise has a decent speed stat. And she, at least having, like, having an extra fat unit that can fly, because Elise has, like, 12 defense in Wyvern, it's crazy. Uh, I think we'll be. I think we will be thankful that we have Elise. Okay. Sidebarring on the Wyvern point, can we just like collectively agree? If Camilla ever dies, whoever killed her is a yeah, traitor. Yeah, that person is getting fucking voted out. <laughs> like, I think we can all shake hands on this because, like, if you get Camilla killed on Chapter Thirteen, Dorena. Like, I, I, I'm sorry, you're, you're, you're getting voted. Okay. So, is there anything else people want to discuss, or do you want to go into the vote? Let me just give me like I just need to think to make sure that. I'm Speedy, do you want to hear my my move by move breakdown of chapter seven? It doesn't so matter because I, I don't think any. <laughs> who, who did chapter eight again? Uh, I did chapter eight, and there wasn't anything particularly yeah, suspicious going suspicious, into it. Like, then that just means Link played it normally. Yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, he could I, be biding his time, Link, but like. I'm not going to vote for Link because it's a 50-50, but... It's a 50-50? It's a 50-50. It's a 50 it's 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 either right so. or you're not. Uh, you're come right on, come on. Come on. Don't, don't understand. It's, it's like, like, it's like that... Uh, <laughs> oh it's gosh. more like a 90 It's like that, I'm, I'm it's like that uh, one me. Look, I'm a genetic look, freak and I'm not normal. So you've got a 50-50. You have a 25%. It's like it's like Linking has a 50% chance of being traitor, regardless I'm just of the saying, odds. It's, just, it's natural for him it to be the traitor. Dude, if you... You know, you play Among Us with me. You remember how often I never... Get and I nailed it every time, but no one listened. <laughs> Link, no one there are things. Oh, yeah, Jay's there right. are Jay, things beyond Jay, statistics. Jay, who there do you think the traitor is? the universe beyond our, our control, if, and that's if I, you. I could, okay, I, I guess are we are we going to throw out... Uh, no, because you're now? a godlike detective. Yeah, so just, I want to know what you think. So, if I was to be honest, if I was to be honest, I think it's, I think it's Cyan, Pavis, and Link. They're a little bit suspicious to me. Pavis hasn't said much, yeah, so I've also yeah, been so suspicious I, so of Pavis. I'll be honest, you three are a little suspicious to me, because, uh, you can say, I mean, like, because the thing is that you can say you have Quest brain rot, but, like, I feel like you are the most knowledgeable Conquest player here. He beat an I, Iron Man of Lunatic. Yeah, yeah I mean, it took so a while. So you two are clearly I was literally doing a Quest at the time of recording, like... But My brain was conquest, not in this. You play conquest through so much that I like can't help but feel a little like taken aback when you said like, yeah, I, I, I had brain rot for this particular part. That like I just that I'm just kind of no. that I'm kind of a little little shocked. And then in core and quest, I normally don't bother getting it because money is not an object. My objective for eight was specifically to try and get like our Corin among us as much XP as we could because I didn't know what all everyone would be comfortable using. So, no matter what, having like Corin of a bunch of XP, I figured was like the play because I only had one chapter to go off of in, ter in terms of like who people wanted to train. Like if I had Wyvern Elise going into this, I would have been training Wyvern Elise. But like I think the only thing you could throw at me is like, oopsie daisy, I didn't get the money, but like. Again, brain was elsewhere. Okay, first of all, first of all, before I go into that, uh, I'm assuming nobody trained up at least to level. I mean, uh, Azura to level ten, right? I mean, I didn't scum it. 
I mean, oh, wait. no, I just no. used No, Azura's normally. alive, yeah. She's there. Okay. She's alive. <laughs> I feel like someone needs, would need to mention if Azura was dead. No, I, I... She's there. I'm trying to remember if she was on my chapter, but she was there. Did anybody trade Azura up to level 10? I'm assuming no. That's fine. If it comes to me, I'll just do it if I'm not on chapter 15. Um, uh, other than that, uh, Cyan, it's not really an oopsie-daisy to lose 10,000 of your 20,000 possible gold on... It's an oopsie-daisy to not rush the bottom left house... It's, I guess, but like because more still... enemies will spawn in, and then you can get like more Corin XP. Which which chapter is this? Uh, it is the uh, like, Fra. The Flora lights herself on fire chapter. Okay. Well, the same location. It's the one where you fight Kielma. It's where you get Niles and Odin. Uh, so for context, uh, why I'm being thrown under the proverbial bus? Uh, if you do not visit, was it three enough houses? You don't get the monetary reward. Yes, you need to visit three. Uh, to, you need to visit three houses to get 10k, two houses to get 5k, one house to get 1k. And uh, correct me if I'm wrong here. Let me check the save file. Uh, I mean, let me check the video. Sorry. Uh, yeah, we had we had 3,000 gold toting into this. Wait, did you visit? No, 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 no. That's beyond sus because you start off with. I think you start off with 3,000 gold. So that I think that means Cyan visit did not one, not two, not three, but zero of the villages. No, I visited the house at the beginning. Okay, so that's that that's free. You can literally just like fly someone into it. At I just most, hung out in the center and just like funneled X. Yeah, no, I did only do that, but like I, I just hung out in the center and funneled XP into Corin. I, I I'm, I'm voting for linking. You know, with all that advice, and if we king, and if I. I expected this to be unanimous. It's just like, let's get Link out of here because he's going to be a headache no matter what. And he's yeah. going to run a I'm fine with having anyway. a headache as long as it's a headache that doesn't fucking ruin the run on literally the first chapter. Y you well, really think chance, that... Otherwise, I would have ruined it on the first chapter. Well, yeah, but I mean, that's fine. If you, if, if, we, if you don't have a chance, if you don't have an option to fuck with us and you don't fuck with us, then as far as I'm concerned, that's fine. By, fine that's good, good in my book. I'll just make sure that you never have a chance to fuck with us. Oh, you don't know me well enough. Well, at least I'll try. <laughs> oh, I'm, you innocent soul. <laughs> okay, Listen, going down the list in VC chat, though. Like, Pavis was... Pavis killed Silas. Yeah. Which I still don't like. I feel like killing on the first turn... Like, no, that's a level of bad Bobber, fire I, emblem that I don't no, no, no. trust. I, I that that it, I you have ever I seen me play <laughs> these games, bro? <laughs> yeah, you haven't seen Pavis play for long enough, dude. Turn one? Seen, what, I like, hate Bobber, turn one, though. Shit. Listen, chapter, that chapter with the... With Azura, like, the intro is deceptively hard because there's, like, a lot of enemies there. I, I can understand how someone When did die. you say you killed Silas? Was it, like, midway through or was it, like, near the beginning? He said turn one. It was right at the beginning. Yeah. Is it a turn yeah. one player phase or enemy phase? How? It was enemy phase. Okay. How? Because you, you uh, can just pull them one by one. You I can th pull them actually, one by I one. I think though. I pulled them all though. Is the, the no, no, no. You, you can only pull one of them without. Uh, there's one enemy that you can pull without pulling all the other enemies, but the others you have to pull at the same time. Except for like the. I, I'm, like, I'm looking at my footage. I got them all. I don't know. <laughs> so you just like threw Silas in before chapter ten and like just assumed he'd be fine to eat three people. I mean, it's content. No, I, I no, respect he said it. He, missed. he said he missed a seventy. No, I threw I threw Effie in to bait them. And then on my okay, so this was actually turn two because I'm looking at the footage. I threw Effie. In, okay. I threw Effie in to bait all five, like, and I got all five in. It wasn't to bait all five, but I got all five. And then on the player phase when I was trying to kill all of them, like, or I was trying to, I was gonna get the amount of kills required. I think I was. Let me look here. Yeah, I got most of them off the board. I need to kill. Yeah, I was gonna get three of five of them off the board, but then Effie actually missed a 70 on a critical move, and then Silas just got fucking jumped by two archers and a Naginata motherfucker. Mm -hmm. I, I I think that I think that honestly, like from what I know of Pavis' skill level, no offense, but I mean you you're the guy that's been saying that you're trash at this game, so I feel like I'm allowed to say this as well. Um, Pavis is um, if he wanted to, because chapter nine is a chapter where you can seriously shit the bed. Like, you could have gotten, like, two units killed, and it would have been... You could have theoretically passed it off as, like, if you played it really well, you could have passed it off as being normal. I think getting Silas killed... Silas is that unit where, like, if you... if you, Like, it's he's a big safety net for the early game, but we're kind of past the early game. We're in the mid-game now. We can sort of manage without Silas. It does suck, but we can figure 
you can figure this shit out. Uh, I think that Pavis, what Pavis did was fucked, but also not that much of a like not that suspicious compared to some of the other stuff we've seen. It's not that mm. suspicious. <laughs> I mean, we can't get Sophie now for like a long term unit. Well, we have to figure out parallel situations. Well, I mean, like in a general sense, no matter how we're doing it, we do lose out on two. Yeah, we have Perry, which is probably fine for like a long. Okay, Cap. You guys are actually gonna make me use Perry. I hate all of you. <laughs> Dude, you're, it's your fault for thinking she's oh, bad. Oh, don't worry, she's Sonic. You don't have to. I don't this. look. It's a Hortensia situation. I don't care if she's good. I don't like her. Her design makes me sad. This is not a game where you can get away with using a unit because you don't like them. This is conquest. We don't fuck around here. I'm sorry, who made Wyvern Elise, all right? <laughs> yeah, that's me, not Who killed around. my Bozu? Around too much. Yeah, killing Mozu is also a bit sad, but also, yeah. Mozu is way worse than Perry, dude. No, incorrect. Mozu is based and can, like, uh, take care of Tankumi. Uh, Cyan, that's a Diogo take, bro. That's a Diogo <laughs> take. Oh, my God. oh, God, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> that's so mean. Um, if we're ready to get to voting, I'm ready to get to voting, too. Well, are we I, doing I this think... voting anonymously? Oh, uh, we could do that. I don't even have it. Uh, uh, I think in Among Us, does it tell you colors? Like, yeah, it tells it you colors. Tell if we're there's, going like Among Us rules, it, we should. But know. there's also, I mean, this is open for discussion. Do you guys want to do it just out there, or would you rather I mean, do it anonymously? I, think I mean, what we could do is we could go into VC chat, type in our answer, and then everybody sends it the exact. Same I think that's. The, I think that's the. I think that's the play. Um, okay. If we have, if we have two people tied for uh, who's going to get voted out, we can just uh, like tell. We can just make it so that those are the only two people you can vote for, and we have an odd number of people, so you're going to be uh, somebody's going to be get, get taken out. Wait, so are we, we doing are we it right now? Between two people, or are we just? No, we, you vote for one. We'll break okay. the tie if we need to. Okay. You can vote for it yourself if you really wanted to. But... <laughs> oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> Chaos. The only Shit. way to redeem himself, I have to Shit. vote for myself. They would never expect this. No, because it needs to be a clean sweep across the board. It has to be perfectly unique. Yeah, it's it's like it's like in Donald Trump when you see that one person that didn't vote for you. It's like ah, oh, it's so close. All right, I'm gonna count down for five, and you you put press enter on when I say go. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Okay, our votes are Cyan, 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 J and J. Looks like Cyan is getting voted out. Um, I didn't want to do this anyway. You killed Mozu. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, honestly, it might just be better for you because we're gonna have to use Perry and Mozu is dead. So it might just be better for your mental state that we don't. You don't have to play this. Yeah, this was this run was about to get really toxic. <laughs> Damn, no one actually voted for me. What the hell? No. You have, I, there's I really to go should have on. voted for myself. I changed it last minute. <laughs> the thing is, Link King, saying that we're going to vote for you is funny. Actually voting for you is just stupid in this situation. No, like, it's not. It's completely good content. By next... <laughs> no, 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 you don't understand. <laughs> you don't understand. By next round, Think we're going to have your evidence to evict, He's you, begging uh, to evict you anyway. So we'll just do it then. Yeah, you guys will probably get rid of me next week. You're just going to waste your vote by voting for you this round. Um, do okay, we get to find out who... If, if Cyan was innocent or not? Uh, no. We do not. Okay. Well, well, though basically, oh, damn, uh, I'm gonna, gonna tell and I'm gonna tell L Trank, who's the person who assigned us our roles, that Cyan is out. Uh, if both the imposters are out, he'll just tell us that we won. Okay. Basically. Got it. Uh, either way, before Cyan leaves, I just want to say thank you so much for participating in this run. I really appreciated it. Um, it's been a lot of fun doing this, and uh, it's this is a way of playing Fates, uh, or even just Fire Emblem in general that I just I'm happy I came up with, and I just want to say thank you. Promoted Niles is dead. <laughs> That's a master seal in a promoted Niles. I will. Okay. I will. I will. I will bring a quote from my own video. Hold on. Let me. Let me get there. Really. <laughs> oh, he's self-quoting. He's definitely. Myself, we we I, messed up. I rallied twice. I rallied twice. Uh, with with uh, Laszlo to get Niles the the buff as well. And I say, I say, are you fucking kidding me? That was a 3%. <laughs> okay, I, I, I do want to say, though, um, uh, the reason I didn't vote for Jay is because if Cyan gets voted out, I can sort of redeem this Wyvern Elise situation because I'll have Chapter 14 and I'll be able to get her promoted and mm. at a good level. A little sussy. Bro, you're going to see mm. a Malig Elise with, like, 17 magic, and you're going to be like, holy shit, she's just going to one-round everything. And He's acting like I'm going to give him the chance. To train up Wyvern. Gonna push her off. <laughs> you kill yeah, Elise. Link. Like, Linking, if you're gonna kill somebody, just kill, make it, make it at least funny. Like, killing Elise is just not funny, because she's already, like, bad for literally everybody except for me. Alright, fine, I'll do Camilla. 
Yeah, see, then we can just book Perfect. you up for sure. Right, shake on it. Yeah. Shake, yeah, yeah handshake, yeah. Uh, you vote out Camilla. I, I can, I can still make this run work. <laughs> Stupid. Watch, watch me accidentally get Camilla killed, and all of you guys vote me out next week. It's Listen, gonna I'm gonna give you so, I'm gonna happens. give you so many tips for Chapter 13 that you're gonna hate me. Like I got the strat for you locked and loaded. I'm gonna send it to you, and you're gonna fucking love it. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna be like, oh my god, how did I never? So are, do this are we playing this run, or Nothing is it you up. playing through us? Like, what, which, which is it? Yeah, you're kind of <laughs> just like backseating a little hard. I get it, your that's, channel, that's, but that's fair. Uh, I mean, if you're if, okay, purpose. I, I'll just say that this way: if you want the help, then let me know, and I'll give you the help. If you don't want the help, then just uh, then just don't, and I won't help you out for that chapter. See if we can bait out some shit advice. I'm, I can't. Oh, that's a good idea. I didn't see that. I, I naturally give shit advice because advice because I'm so biased. Because uh -huh. I'll be like, yeah, use use oh. use Odin on this map, even though it might not be the best idea to use Odin or some shit like that. Because I because I love because I love some units. I'll be like, yeah, you uh, yeah, give Perry the armor slayer. She's the best person to use it, even though you could probably do the same thing with Selena. So the wells. Well, you don't have an you don't even have an armor slayer, yep. and you're having to use Perry. And oh, no yeah, dual club. Fun. Yeah, I think that's enough. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, please leave a like. The next chapter is going to go to is going to go back to Link King. He's going to be on chapter thirteen, which is my favorite map. Uh, hopefully, he doesn't throw too much. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.